Greetings. In this brief tutorial, we're going to take a look at how to log into Neo's ELA using your Clever application. First thing, of course, you're going to do is go into the White Plains website and uh, then go into Clever. Now, it would actually help if you've already logged into Office 365 because then it will automatically log you into Clever. If not, you'll have to log in through Clever. Once you're there, um, you want to make sure that you um, click on the Neo CLA application. That's the end. And once you're there, um, you're going to notice that, well, your name is already there. You already have an account with uh, Neo CLA. Uh, some of you may be familiar with it, some of you may not. So the first thing you want to do is go into the finder. And once you click there, click on assignments. And you're going to notice that, well, you're going to see some data there. You want to go all the way to the bottom, and there you're going to find the work that has been assigned to you by your teachers. In this particular um, article, you can click on it, and um, obviously you want to check for the article that whatever whoever assigned to you. These articles, uh, you will notice, are different per um, uh, uh, lexile level, which means that they, some of them may be harder than others. The higher the number, the more complex the text will be. Make sure that you choose what is correct, what is right for you, whatever is more challenging for you, or whatever you feel comfortable with. I suggest you go for what's comfortable for you. When you're ready to answer, you want to click on quiz and you want to answer the questions. And for the written part, you want to make sure you click there and then choose the class that you're going to submit this to. Of course, in my case, if you're writing something for social studies, you want to click into your social studies class. So it's very easy. You just type your text where it says type response and then click submit when you are done. It's actually that simple. That's all you have to do in terms of submitting written work and your questions. Please make sure that you do all parts and make sure that you go back to the assignment and take a look at uh, the information that is um, that is um, that you're supposed to do. And uh, that is all for this tutorial. I hope it was helpful.